You know what? You never know what you might want to cut and make into uh, <laughs> some clips later. Mm. This is where BP Raw comes in. You get a lot of material out of there. It's not going to make your coat all dry, is it? Mm. That's why I got a water bottle. Uh, Damn cracker. Got my throat all dry and scratchy. <laughs> mm. So what's up, Jake? What's going on? Well, I mean, it is coming to be mid to late October. Oh, yeah? We, uh, BP crew, friends for life, whatever you want to call it, uh, have best, best pals, best pals, <laughs> have a, uh, uh, I don't want to call it a ritual, but it's an take, annual trip. We take an annual trip every year, Vegas. Not annual, annual. Yeah, a annual. I'm sorry. <laughs> annual, annual trip. Yeah. We take every year, uh, as a group, mm -hmm. our, our legendary, uh, world famous Vegas trips. Yeah. Las Vegas. Oh yeah. We do Halloween. Sometimes we do group costumes. I would say, yeah, let's say it's uh, famous. I mean, we get kicked out of bars a lot, especially you. Well, I mean, yeah. I'm gonna be kicked out of bars too. Me, you. <laughs> a, a, a affronts to my freedom would probably be a better way to put it. <laughs> I thought this was America. Free country. <laughs> right. I thought I could dance anywhere I wanted. <laughs> this is America. I can dance where I want. Yeah. You can, yeah. just don't knock tables off. I can dance if I want to. <laughs> I can leave my friends, friends behind. <laughs> yeah. But if so. you don't dance, then you're no friend of mine. Yeah. Uh, yeah you say it like it happens a lot. It doesn't it, happen. It, we only go once a year, so, I mean, by definition, it couldn't even happen that often. Yeah. By, by just how things align. So, so this year. Uh, yeah, this year Gary and I were going to be staying at the Cosmopolitan, and uh, Cosmo, Cosmo's yeah. uh, one of the more expensive, expensive places, one of the higher end establishments. Uh, it was at one point, and then it started to, you know, fall from grace. Okay, it started going down a little bit. People started complaining, and then it got. Uh, Remodeled, I think uh, they put in five hundred million dollars in renovations. Half a bill. Yeah. You yeah. have any idea the capacity, room numbers, or anything? No, I don't. But I don't they have two towers. But uh, uh, I know it's big. I've been through a couple of times. Three thousand rooms is what it says. Yeah, that's a huge place. And then uh, you know what sucks is, so uh, it just got sold. Yeah. The Cosmopolitan. <laughs> they got sold to the MGM. The and, MGM uh, Alliance? So, you know, I signed up for their Cosmopolitan uh, rewards program and all this stuff this year. Yeah, because you're going to spend so much cash. While right. Yeah. And then they got sold to MGM. So all this, all that stuff, the, the points, you know, you, we accrued it for the room. And mm -hmm. it, it's just going to go away because they're not transferring it over to uh, MGM. It doesn't work that way. So now, uh, now I have to open up an MGM account. An MGM program. rewards account. Right. So what about all the money you spent on the room and stuff like nope. that? It does not transfer over. Sorry. No refunds. No refunds. Well, I mean, it's not officially MGM yet, but um, by the time we could use the points. Right. Yeah, I guess that's fair because you have to accrue them before you could use them. Uh, don't you have to stay in the room first? And then you get will you get some, I think so yeah will you get some points that you get like okay so you show up on Thursday and then you get all the points for showing up and then on Friday you use because you're gonna spend you know pretty chunk of change there yeah but uh, they made uh, wherever they sold it to they made some good money they sold it for 5.65 billion dollars and then the previous owner uh, bought it for I think it was 1.7 billion. So well, that's four times as much money. Back in 2014. Whew. So what is that? Seven years? They almost triple. Yeah, almost tripled their money. That's a lot of money. That is a lot of money. Mm -hmm. Gosh, but all. Unrealistic amounts of money. But yeah, yeah. Uh, hotel, I mean, uh, I think right now with I mean, it's still a great hotel. Oh, again, it's one of the top hotels yeah. as far as 
price and I bet even like ratings and stuff. I mean, yeah. I've been through there. It's a nice place. Mm -hmm. There's no arguing with well, it's that. It's always the best place to eat breakfast. The Henry? Uh, yeah, because you good. see all the girls go to the pool party. <laughs> yeah. Like walking through there. Yeah. No, so, and I think it's just going to get better with under, because the Cosmo was owned by, it was just the, their only property. Uh, Independently owned. Right, in Vegas. Mm -hmm. And now that's part right. of the NGM. An independent establishment. Or, yeah. It was owned by, uh, who owned it? Blackstone? So now, uh, now that it's part of NGM, I think it's just going to get better. Because NGM likes to keep that that status symbol. It'd be like the crown jewel. I mean, it's right in the middle. Yeah, uh, I mean, yeah. It's, well, that's the thing. It's so well located. Well, it's freshly renovated. Uh, mm -hmm. The MGM rewards program is one of the better ones. Don't you have an MGM's uh, credit Me? card? I have a Caesar. Is it Caesar's? Yeah, oh. I have the Caesar's rewards. Because I, I got it at that tournament. Oh, okay. That's where I signed up for everything. I thought you had a credit card, too. I got the credit card there, too. I, I got a really it. good rate yeah. on it. It's actually, out of all the credit cards I have, it's the best rate. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Sounds like you got suckered in. Mm -hmm. oh, it's got a great rate, like I swear to No, 16%. <laughs> something like that. <coughs> it's my lowest. Oh, yeah. My credit cards. Yeah. Yeah. They gave me a, a hell of a limit, too. It was like seven grand, six grand, something like that, but I never used it. Yeah. And then after a year, they bumped it down, and now it's like 900 bucks. <laughs> <That's terrible>. <laughs> <laughs> you want to pull some cash out on your Yeah, card card no. I used it once because you, you, <laughs> you had to have a You had to have a hole in that pocket. No, not on a credit card. Fuck. But it's a low rate. It's only 16%. Yeah, but if I put $1,000 on there, that's $160 a month to just an interest. Well, but if you win big. You it's true. Out. It's true. Yeah. I always spend the money after I win. Don't fear the reaper. Right now, oh, lightning. No, wait a minute. You're supposed to. Fix. That's exactly what yeah. you're supposed to do. It's the opposite of the song. <laughs> Gotta ride that lightning. Ride the lightning. Yeah. Oh, you're in man. Vegas. Well, I also don't want to go deeply into debt. Last thing I need is some strip club to charge me $3,500. And then what are you going to do? Ruin well, my marriage? Yeah. <laughs> you better not if I mean, you got the cash for it. Yeah. <laughs> I always uh, imagine myself the gambler and that I'm going to, you know, uh, go to Vegas and poker tournament and win. And it's going to cover the trip. And I'm, yeah. That's why I go to Vegas. You know, uh, I'm a gambler. I, yeah. It pays for itself. I think the only uh, guy who's ever uh, hit it big, I think it was your brother. On, uh, Don't even movie. get me started on that. The roulette thing. table. What, he went twice in a row or something? Yeah. Like that? Put, How do you call numbers like that? He put all his money on that one number. Because <laughs> usually you're supposed to spread it out because yeah. it's 35 numbers plus mm -hmm. your zeros. Plus double, double zeros. zeros right. yeah. He's like, no, this one. I'm feeling it. <laughs> this, this is it. And it hit. Yeah. And then it hit again. And then what did he do? It's, well, it's he like, just pocketed the money and didn't do anything. Put it all in his pocket and <laughs> turned around and walked away? Yeah. Because I think it's like 10 times the payout or something. 35 like, times. 35 times. 30, yeah. yeah. Oh, if you call so him the 10 number. bucks, <laughs> gives him 350 bucks. Yeah. And then did he let the 350 ride? <laughs> no, he did another 10. So he ended up with 700. But still. Yeah. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. All of his money was 10 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> he bet it all. Yeah. My highest, 100% of the money. My highest uh, earnings were, uh, I was playing three card poker. Oh yeah? And, um, and it, I had 10 bucks on the, on the table and it was three of a kind pays uh, six to one. Or 60 to one, sorry. 60 to one? Yeah, so I ended up making just the, uh, cause not only did I win that, but, but I also beat was... the dealer. Mm -hmm. So I ended up making like 750 bucks. That's and once I won, I was like, right, I'm cashing out. <laughs> and the dealer was like, well, why? You just won. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, see <laughs> I'm yeah. done. <laughs> you you want to get tipped or not? I know. It's, it's funny when the dealer's always trying to guilt trip you. And, uh, <clears throat> like, come mm -hmm. on, man. You went in. Go yeah. all the way now. I was like, no, no, I'm done. No, that's fine. They tipped him 25 bucks. So. Yeah, I'm sure he appreciated it. That's that. when we went to that um, steakhouse, uh, Ramsey Steakhouse in, uh, in, in the uh, Paris. The Gordon Ramsey one? Gordon Ramsey. What did I say? You said the Gordon Ramsay, yeah. 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 That's the day you got chicken at a steakhouse. I was so upset about the beef wellington. It hurt my feelings. And so I was going to pay. And then it ended up costing me. <laughs> but that steak I had, oh, it's so good. Still, um, it's up there. It's 
One of the best? Yeah. Uh, did you want to talk about what your plans are for this Vegas trip? Well, so we're going on a Thursday. Uh, we usually go up a day early. Mm -hmm. It's a nice leisurely drive on an off day. And, uh, you know... Uh, We'll leave Thursday well, morning. Thursday morning, yeah. And we have a uh, rented a car. Well, I mean, I mean, a couple of uh, of the guys were into sports, you know, mm -hmm. and we're uh, from Arizona, so we root for the Cardinals. And there's going to be a game that night: Cardinals versus Packers Thursday night. So we're thinking of watching it at uh, one of the uh, sports bars. Yeah, Beer Garden. Beer, yeah, Beer Park. Beer Park, yeah. yeah. That's it. Beer Park. It's a it's a cool, cool place, and. Um, so we're thinking of doing that. And then Friday night. Uh, Noodle House, we were talking yeah. about. Momofuku. Oh, Momofuku on Thursday. Yeah, we were Thursday. talking about Thursday yeah. for lunch. Uh, well, it well, depends what time we get there. Why Momofuku, though? I'm just curious. What, what about it? Because uh, I think this uh, was your idea. Good. Yeah. Like, me and Michael went to the one in New York, and it was really good. Yeah. Um, I'm thinking maybe, like, late afternoon Friday. For, for Momofuku? Yeah. Well, because oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. let me yeah. let me if if you don't mind, uh, Friday night's the night we're getting dressed up. We're going up for Halloween. Yeah. So Friday night's the costume night, and that's the night for sure we're all going to be together. And I can tell you right now, you know, we're going to want to get a cheap meal like that pizza place. Oh uh, no! Something like that, uh -huh. where everybody will go and eat. Uh -huh. Friday night's that night. I was thinking Thursday we'll go up. We'll do like a small group. We'll go get some noodles before mm -hmm. we check in. Because we'll probably be there a little bit early. Yeah, because the lunch prices are way better at Momofuku. Yeah, so I'm thinking we'll like do the same lunch. Thing. Mm -hmm. Then we'll go to the hotel. We'll get settled, separate, get showered up, whatever. Then we can go out that night and do, do the game. The do game. The day, yeah. And then that'll be our Thursday. Keep it easy because we're going to be there all, all weekend. Yeah. Then Friday. I don't know about doing the Noodle House Friday is what I'm saying. And that's why I was thinking something more. Yeah, like, pizza's fine. I'm not saying necessarily the pizza place, but something kind of more of that. Yeah. Uh, we may have to, just because... Uh, I'm thinking as far as the group goes. Right. You yeah. know, like we're talking because everybody's going to want to eat. That's going to be a rough night. But what we were planning on doing, I'm sorry to step on what you were saying, uh, was get a table Friday night at the Cosmo. Yeah. That was kind of the highlight I thought of the trip. Is going to be a yeah. nice table. We're getting a table for eight, right? So we yeah. got a couple extra spots, uh, you know, putting down some money so we'll have like a nice bar tab. I think and it's going to be. And I'm sure, um, you know, we'll be filming on location. I was also, we, me and Yuli were kind of talking about this earlier, uh, <laughs> doing some sort of like, uh, like a trip compilation. Right. You know, imagine like if every hour you just took like one minute of film. And then as the day gets progressively, so here's like the eight hours we were out on Friday night. And it's like, oh, here's us meeting up and getting you know, dinner. And so everybody's just sober. And then, oh, here's us getting into the club. And then, you know, oh, oh, here's us in the club. And then here's us in the club after two hours. Uh, here's was, Jake getting kicked out. Yeah, here's club. Jake getting forcefully ejected again <laughs> as he snuck back in uh, after getting kicked out the first time. Trying to bribe the uh, bouncer with a bunch of nickels. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't. I couldn't bribe the bouncer with a hundred dollar fucking bill. Mm -hmm. Did we do that once? We tried to. Did you know, remember? We yeah, were, yeah, we yeah, were no, all dressed up for that. And I'm all, oh, you let us in, buddy, and I got a hundo in my hand. Yeah. He's like, no. <laughs> oh. Yeah, oh. I tried that at that Maxim party at the Super Bowl. Maxim Super Bowl party. Yeah. And the dude was like, five hundred each. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, fuck that. And we went and like snuck around the sand trap and through the pool, yeah. and up the fence. <laughs> I got five hundred dollars. Yeah, hundred bucks. That's five hundred. Hundred bucks yeah. for all of us. <laughs> no, you're five hundred. <laughs> ah, fuck. <laughs>